Hi, hello, uh, welcome back. This is the madcenter.com and here are some uh, questions that I picked up from the recent accounting paper IGCSE 0452. Variant is 1 1 for the, from the recent May June 2020 exam. Okay, uh, this, is the, this is from the paper 1. I repeat IGCSE 0452 1 1 May June 2020. So I did. I want to do this and talk about a few questions here, uh, particularly of interest to my students and to any of you out there who are taking uh, this accounting exam. So do follow us on uh, YouTube and Facebook. Give us a like and share this with your friends. Okay, here goes. So uh, question 15 says, a non-current asset was depreciated at the end of the first year. Um, ownership using a straight line method based on the following information. The cost, working life, the residual life is given. It was found that the reducing balance, come on, let me get a hang of this, okay. It was found that the reducing balance uh, method was 30%. Okay, there's a reducing balance, should have been used. Currently, they're using straight line method based on the following information. What was the effect of, uh, for the year of correcting this error? So now I will do it side by side. I like to do it this way. Mm. Let me show you the straight line method and the reducing balance method. Then you can compare it side by side, okay? So here goes. Okay, let's see. Let me get a, some space here, okay? For, so for the straight line, straight line method. Straight line method is pretty easy. It's just the cost, 20,000 of the item minus the residual value uh, over the useful life. So the straight line depreciation is 1604. is simply 4,000 per year, okay? This is for straight line. Now, under residual method, under residual, we have straight away uh, 20,000 times 30%, uh, right? Which is 6,000 a year. Now, this is the first year. We're only calculating the first year's depreciation, right? Depreci depreciated at the end of the first year. Do be very careful when you read this question. So, if you had done it under uh, re reducing method, I'm sorry, if you have done it under reducing method, the depreciation will be 6,000. But uh, since they have uh, charged out the depreciation based on straight line, it was 4,000, okay? So if it just have been, if you had used reducing, it would have been 6,000. So what was the effect on the profit? So therefore, by using 4,000, your expenses, your expense, your depreciation expense is understated by 2,000. How do you get 2,000? 6,000, which is the correct one, minus 4,000, which is 2,000. So hence, uh, expenses is understated by 2,000 and therefore, what was the effect on the profit of correcting, of correcting this error? So okay, we know that expenses are down by 2,000, therefore profit was overstated by 2,000. But when you correct it, you have to push down your profit. You must push down the profit. The medicine you're going to take. Okay, the sickness is the profit is overstated and the, now the medicine you are going to take would be to push down profit by 2000 and hence the answer is A. Okay, and we're done.